very very new yeah um i'm i'm interested i think obviously roy being like a traditional sortie wins a lot of matchups but sephiroth might have an edge here a lot more range mm. in general um, yeah definitely I'm sure, like sephiroth is starved of close quarters moves yeah, Jab sure. is all right, the and the Nair and the nair, the nair is the big one. Mm. Nair into Nair into Nair into whatever move you want. Oh, and also got this, yeah, the the set play move as people will call it. You have to, you, as soon as you get hit by the uh, the dark flare thing, you kind of have to play Sephiroth's game, and you have to be wary at all times of what you're doing. But I, from what I've from what I've heard, uh, uh, Sephiroth kind of suffers with being with being mashed on kind of hard, and that's kind of what Roy does. He mashes on you. Yeah, I don't think being tall helps either. I don't think being as light as he is helps either. Yeah, he's literally like Kirby weight, right, or something stupid. Oh, that is sad. Stupid. That is sad. That, I... Yeah, the multi hits. Yeah, that's that's rough. Yeah, got the dark flare or whatever it's called. Oop. Oh, okay, not quite gonna follow up out of there, but I like the idea. Oh, the shield break! Oh, that's <gasps> it. He's dead. Yeah, just forward smash. No need to charge anything. I mean, I would have liked to personally see the fully charged neutral B, but you know, that is what it is. Oh yeah, the hit the counter also having a hitbox anyway is very, very strange, because you actually have to like full on hold shield against it rather than just wait for it to be be over and hit it. I like mean, you do with to mine. be fair, like it's predictable enough that you could counter it on reaction. Oh yeah, for sure. It's it's just very it, Of course, yeah, I didn't think about that. It's uh it's just a strange move though, you know. It's a very odd move. Oh, we've hmm. seen the one-winged angel come out again. The one-winged angel basically just makes him into a, a, a broken character. <laughs> makes him faster and... Yeah, and it's everything. very stock dependent. I mean, there's a lot of factors that go into it, depending on stock and percent. It's mm. a bit weird. There's no real way of, like... There's no, like, clear outline. Mm. Um, but the fact that it is stock dependent is super good. Yeah. Um, Does anyone know if uh, it... Does it just change his properties, or does it make his special stronger as well? I'm not actually sure 100% how it works. Um, it just, it's kind of a bit more like deep breathing in that it just changes his properties, and it right. also gives him, although it, it gives him an extra jump. Oh um, yeah, of course, yeah, he gets the extra and jump. And it gives him super armor as well. Right. Oh yeah, on his smash attacks, right? Yeah, because I never actually, yeah. oh, that, like that. There it is. Because <laughs> I didn't actually watch the, uh, the presentation on him, because I was at work at the time, so... Oh, the other uh, hang, of course. Oh, okay, and off goes GP. So very even once again. <laughs> these two uh, scrapping right now. Yeah. You can see that Contact has kind of played the matchup. He's not falling for like back throw, back air, and stuff like that. Mm. So maybe not a huge amount. I mean, everybody was playing Sephiroth and a lot of people still are, it's a very popular character now, so... I just, I look at Sephiroth and I'm just really glad that I have a good crowd. You know, and I think characters with decent characters could probably do quite well. Oh, Ooh, the counter! Oh, the counter, that was cool. Dang. I literally, I literally turned away to do some TOing stuff like once. Oh, here we go. I've got, I'm going to leave that on the screen for a bit because it looks so sick. It does. Is he doing the walk away? Is this the walk away? No. One? No, it's just the, the stare no, into the camera. Not. Have you seen the Isabel version of the walk away one? Yeah, I have. Yeah. Yeah, that's brilliant. <laughs> Ouch. So we actually have uh, Vulcan in Winner's Side Top 8 already. Thank you for the follow, Reptile. Good to see you. Thanks for entering today. Yeah, Vulcan's already in Top 8. Uh, Reptile looking to make his way into Top 8, but he has to play the x or Cretan, which will be on stream next, by the way. So stay tuned for that. That should be exciting. We got some, yeah, losers a little far behind because I had to reset a load of rounds because I had to DQ a couple of people for lying about where they were from. Uh, so don't do that, please, everyone. I'm trying. I'm doing this in my own. I'm doing this in my own time. 
If you are not from the UK or Ireland, don't sign up. I'm sure there's plenty of other things you could do, or just play Elite Smash. Please do not waste my time, because I'm already, you know, I'm doing this out of my own time for no pay anyway. So just don't do this, okay? Thank you. Anyway. Or watch the stream. <laughs> yeah, or watch the stream. Watch the stream, you know, have a good time. But don't don't lie to me and tell me you're from UK and Ireland when you're not, okay? Because I'm I, like they're banned now, and they're not going to be able to end. Like if I were to do, if I were to do something now that's no region restriction, they wouldn't be allowed in because they're now banned. Okay. Yeah. So. Oh, the counter was I love genius. The counter. Oh, what the? Oh. Oh, that did that? Yeah, you can break his counter with enough damage. Right. Okay. I've net right. It, it, so you can tell it I didn't. It doesn't uh, look like projectiles, by the way. It only absorbs them. Right. But you can also break it in the same way. I see. Interesting. Oh, contact really piling on the pressure now, knowing that um. Sephiroth kind of struggles with that. Oh, I like it though. Get the uh. The read on that pet roll in. Yeah, the uh, the tech, the um, I can't remember what it's called. The side B though. It, it's good for covering yeah. tech rolls apparently. And you can see. Uh, Another GP thing that um. Bit. Contact just did was use up B, knowing that the two side B players would basically cancel out the end lag, or at least put him in a much better position. To yeah, the, exactly. Uh, you can go for the risk without the reward. Yes, exactly. The yeah, that's right. Oh, here we go, the big ball of flame. The 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 fully charged neutral B is honestly one of the coolest moves in the game. It's so so Ooh. cool looking. Very uh, hotly contested once again, guys. He took his jump with that side B. Yeah. That was a very oh, dangerous is... situation. Oh, this is looking really rough now. This is looking really bad for uh, GP. He can't yeah. get back on the stage. <laughs> I was gonna say, if he actually just charged forward smash, that move is so laggy that he probably could have landed it. He probably could have, yeah, because uh, Roy's one is like frame 14 or something. It's really quick. Oh my god, <gasps> really? Oh yeah, the, Sephiroth is super light. He's I keep away. forgetting. He's yeah, he's away. like Kirby weight. Goodness me. Yeah, no, the same weight as Kirby and Pika. Yeah, it's it's. I I I'm glad they did that because this character definitely has a hell of a neutral and stuff. But. Uh -oh. uh oh, I love that move. It looks so cool. <laughs> it looks so sick. <laughs> it does. I, I love, I love that they put the extra like. It, it feels like they put the extra cool visual design into the uh, DLC characters because they obviously work them like one at a time. Um, yeah. And yeah, it just, it just feels so. It just looks so cool when they get the extra little flare on like the. Well, in this case, definitely the flare, because it's a flare move. Mm. We're gonna see the explosion. I think they, all the DLC do look quite nice. Yeah, they apart definitely from, do. Apart from Byleth Final Smash. Yeah, Byleth. Byleth. Yeah, Final Smash looks like shit. It's like literally just a, a PNG of uh, the lady in the background. It's very odd. Oh, and also uh, Minecraft stage. I don't know if you've ever noticed, but the background is literally just like a low-quality JPEG. I, I used to, I yeah, used to not notice it, but like, now I've noticed it. I can't unsee it. It looks really gross. It's not, it's not that low quality, but it's like they wanted to have like a 3D model using like similar Minecraft generation. Or oh my god! To do a thing like, ooh, ooh, where you could import your own worlds in. Oh, okay. But um, I don't really have time to do either of that because obviously they already had quite a lot. Yeah. Um. So they just put a thing in. But you can find that world online. I think the world seed people found it. Oh, that's pretty so cool, though. Still interesting. I Part of me is a bit annoyed that the Minecraft stage is legal. Yeah. I think... I remember think I, I remember a while ago I tweeted out um, the potential legality of, like, all the forms. Because uh, one of them is, like... <clears throat> one of them is, like, Castle Siege without a slope in the middle. Stuff like that. Yeah. I mean, it's a, it's a bit bigger than Castle Siege as well. The platforms on the Minecraft stages are quite like big in general, yeah. but they're like hollow stage. Mm, definitely some uh, unique unique layouts to be sure. Yeah, you could probably run a stage list that was just those stages. Yeah, you, you actually unironically un probably could. Just oh. run a stage list filled with like banned DLC stages. Mm. It's the um. The Sephiroth stage. Oh yeah, Yugdrazzle. Northern Northern Cave, right? Northern Cave. Yeah, Northern Cave, Yggdrasil, Mementos, and oh, Minecraft yeah. stages. Yggdrasil is cool, but um, the the music gets like all copyright struck apparently. So. I'm not even sure if it's that. I feel like apparently it was like really distracting. I to like play on. Yeah, but like I don't know. I I 
I think part of it is the music, um, like an actual part of it is the music, because uh, if you put it on U the VODs on YouTube, you'll just get like DMCA'd. Um, oh, that's... Yeah. Yeah, it does yeah. yeah, and especially with Twitch, like changing their policy on that now, it could happen uh, on Twitch as well. But uh, another part of it is like, um, ugh. It, it, it's weird because it's so wide, it's very easy to plank on because you can actually, a lot of moves will go through the actual stage itself, so you can plank on it quite easily. Oh, interesting. Mm. I think I think it's a very pretty stage. I quite like the background and everything. I don't personally find it distracting, but I remember I was when I played this game. I would, I played a friend who also, who played Ridley, and he could literally plank on the on one of the ledges, and his up air would go through the stage, and I couldn't do anything about it. Oh. He could like plank super duper hard. Um, I should pick a drizzle in arenas and start planking. <laughs> start playing Ridley on it just to plank people. <laughs> you are evil. No, though I already play Weep, it's fine. True. And also, like, Sephir Sephiroth was down air would have a hell of a time on that stage. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sephiroth's down air is, like, the anti-plank tool of the century. Yeah. That move, like, they deliberately gave the landing hitbox of that move a huge spike. Yeah, yeah. Which is smart, because it means it's a storm fall down air, but it has, like, practical use. I'm gonna say that was a beautiful up air from GP there to uh, get yeah. contact away from oh, the, the ledge. Shield yeah, that's uh, that shields. Looking kind of low. Yeah. And now contact needs to find this stock sooner rather than later because you got a Sephiroth with one winged angel staring down you. Yeah. Oh, I like the oh, I like the counter. Interesting. Oh my god. This is looking really tough all of a sudden. Nice We're going to see this. The ledge trapping. Yeah. Ooh, the up tilt to catch him. Don't ever forget that there's one stronger than Giga Flare and only Donald Duck can use it in the uh, in the Final Fantasy canon. It's called like Terra Flare, I think. And I forgot Kingdom Hearts was Final Fantasy canon. Yeah. Oh my god. You know Kingdom Hearts is also Pixar canon. Of course, yeah. Because uh, right. of Toy Story, right? I was very disappointed Soul lacked uh, any Sephiroth. <laughs> so. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of low-key wanted a. Um... Oh god. Yeah, but yeah, only Donald Duck can use Terra Flare, so he, uh, which is, I believe, a billion times stronger than than Giga Flare or something stupid like that. You know? oh, god, of course yeah. it is. Yeah, like Donald Duck Thanks is is lots. actually the strongest mage in Final Fantasy history. But uh, what I was going to say is the smart thing about Giga Flare is you can act a little bit just before it comes out. So That's right, yeah. You can you can you add that extra you, you can add that extra little bit of pressure on, right? Yeah, well, we saw that he was using it to sort of buffer an up tilt a little bit early, and then when Contact tried to jump over, he was getting caught. Nice side be there. Contact needs to kind of uh, get this done ASAP because he's looking a little further behind, and it's obviously game three now. I mean, Roy can do it against Sephiroth, because Sephiroth is super light and Roy hits so hard. Yeah, I was just watching Roy rip an F smash and thinking, that would kill. You know what I mean? Like, just one decent confirm, that's all you need. Grab. Oh, that's Ooh, it. I love the no. idea, but that didn't, yeah, I think he's so light that he actually fell out. Now GP's got one wing angel again, which is kind of sad. <laughs> you really need to get this kill now, bro. Oh no. Ooh, the dash attack, oh, yeah. No. Kind of fishing for it. Could have dash grabbed and maybe got some stage control, but. Lyra is doing a really good job. Well, GP is doing a really good job. Oh my! Ooh, oh, wow! I I if that had killed, that would have been tragic. Really good job of playing with a lead. Mm. Oh, here we go. The back air. Okay, this could still Taking, happen. You know, 120. They were like almost even in percents. Mm. Um, at one point, and just getting that extra damage in and making sure that you can use your lead to get, you know, basically an entire stock off. Yeah. This could still happen though. I mean, like uh, Roy with Rage is a character, a uh, light, like is a character that a light character like Sephiroth does not want to fight. A light character. Oh no, never mind. Basketball, mind you. Oh, okay. Just <laughs> jump straight into it. That's unfortunate. Good stuff to GP moving into winners' quarters. Oh, we're gonna see the walk away this time. You know, let's all, let's all admire it.
Yeah. Beautiful. Oh, that's so cool. That is very cool. That is excellent stuff. Good stuff to GP beating contact. A very hard fought set there. Um, right now we're going to be getting into Exga versus Cretin. Now this is going to be fun. Oh, I know both of these people. <laughs> yeah. 